All right, violas, now we're gonna go over your two octave E flat major arpeggio. For this arpeggio, you need E flat, G, and B flat. So let's play what that sounds like in our first octave. E flat. G. E flat. And then low one E flat. Listen again, I'll play those four together. We're going to use low one for the E flat and the B flat, and then low four for the high E flat on the A string. Here's how it sounds E flat, G, B flat, low four E flat. Listen again E flat. Those are all of the notes in your arpeggio. So I'll play it through now two times from top to bottom, and I'll talk you through the first time, and I'll just play it through the second time. Here we go. Low two E flat. <laughs> My wrist stays in one place, my fingers stretch to where they need to go without moving the position of my wrist. Make sure that when you have low finger patterns, especially that you don't do anything like this to try and reach back, reach your finger back without moving your wrist. Here's that whole arpeggio one more time. I won't say anything this time. You can just play along with me uh, and maybe keep an eye on your wrist and make sure that it's staying in the right place. Here we go. Ready, breathe. <laughs> Good luck. Happy practicing.